Hello everybody and welcome to SnackTube. Today I've got an item that I found in my local Iceland. Um, they were on their wee separate shelf and seems to be new flavours of Pringles. So I picked up two different ones. I got the Pringles Sizzling Extra Hot Cheese and Chili and then I got the Bacon Mac and Cheese flavour. So this is the one we're going to try today but I'm also going to try this one on SnackTube so you'll have to subscribe and come back to see it. Ring the bell if you want a notification when that video comes out. So I'm just trying to get a few extra subscribers out of that one. <laughs> right. So Pringles, yes. The first thing I noticed about these is that they're both different sizes. Like you can see that. But they both contain different amounts of Pringles as well. So that one's got 180 grams and this one has 165 grams. Which is weird. I don't know why they would do that. I don't know if maybe this is a newer one and they've decided to put less Pringles in the packet. But uh, yeah, odd. But they were both £1.50. And I don't think these ones should cost any more to produce, you know, they, they're just crisps, but whatever. Um, I'm sure there's a reason behind it, probably one that is, involves making more money. Uh, now, Pringles, you've got your mustachioed Pringle man there, the legend that he is. I saw a picture on Reddit recently where uh, they'd rebranded him and he was more um, simple. And uh, it looked horrifying, it looked really horrifying. So far I haven't seen that in the shops over here yet because I think it might have been in America, but yeah, I hope they don't do that. The classic Pringles man is where, at, where it's at. He's a dapper lad, he really is. Um, so I think this is supposed to be helping to promote Halo, uh, Halo Infinite, which uh, says is coming to Xbox Game Pass. I didn't think it had a release date yet. I know it's supposed to come out this year, but uh, I didn't think it actually had a release date yet. So why they're advertising it now, I don't know. Maybe it's uh, maybe that's a clue. Maybe it is coming out very, very soon. Hopefully. Hope so. Um, I don't know. Please tell me in the comments because I don't know about this. Although by the time this video goes out, to be honest, it'll probably be too late. It'll probably be out by then. But uh, Halo Infinite... I definitely want to play that. I'm a massive Halo fan. Um, I only bought an original Xbox so that I could play Halo with my friends because we used to do LAN parties and things like that. And uh, the Xbox 360, I waited ages to buy that and then only bought it and like played all the Halo games on it in a row. And then when I bought my Xbox One, I'd never planned on buying an Xbox One, but I had a few spare shekels and I decided, hey, I really wanted to play some Halo. So I bought the Xbox One, the Game Pass, and I played through all the old Halo games again, um, as well as whatever the latest one was at the time, Halo 4, I think. I can't remember. But uh, Halo Infinite, I don't know if it's coming out on Xbox One or if it's only coming out on Xbox One X. I'll need to find out because if it is only coming out on the newest console, then that's going to be the, the ball that drops and makes me actually purchase one. I want to get a PlayStation 5 first before I get the Xbox One X, but I uh, suppose it just depends on which one of them decides to release the best games first. PlayStation, I'm waiting for the new Resident Evil. Right, I suppose we should stop talking about video games. This is a food channel after all. Um, so these are limited edition bacon mac and cheese flavour. Uh, these, I've never had these before. I don't know if they're completely new or if it's a reprint, a reprint, or like a rerun of crisps that they've done before. But uh, they sound intriguing. I like bacon. I like cheese. I also like Mac. He's my favourite character on It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. So, let's see what's actually involved in these bad boys. So, they, it says here, they're ham and cheese flavour savoury snack. Bacon, ham flavour, bacon or ham and crisps tends to be the exact same thing. Um, so, it's got dehydrated potatoes, vegetable oils, sunflower and corn, rice flour, wheat, starch, corn flour, ham and cheese seasoning... It's made from lactose powder, cheese powder, flavour enhancers, monosodium glutamate, uh, pepper, uh, yeast extract, buttermilk powder, sugar, flavourings, acids, onion powder, it's black pepper, uh, colour which is paprika extract, smoke flavourings, emulsifier, maltodextrin, corn oil, colour. So unlike normal crisps, these aren't like shaved crisps that are shaved into crispy shapes. These are all perfectly formed, mashed up, dehydrated potato, perfectly formed, which... Um, in a lot of ways is good because you can do funny things like with them like make wee ducky faces and stuff like that so what are our uh, nutritional information so portions per 165 gram package five so quick maths so what's 165 divided by five who can get it before me uh, 33 
quick maths there. I was always pretty good at maths in school. Um, I do have a higher in maths. I think I got a B. Um, but doing mental arithmetic, I'm just, I don't know why, but I'm so slow at it. Anyway, or um, maybe that was quick by your standards. I don't know. Um, I'm no genius. Anyway, what have we got? So, per so it actually says per 30 grams, okay. Uh, 161 calories, which is reasonably high for crisps. Uh, normally, it'd be a little bit less than that for normal crisps, but it's not that huge. Uh, fat, 9.6 grams, which is quite high. Saturates, 1 gram. It's not too bad. Uh, 17 grams of carbs, 1.2 grams of sugar. That's expected from potatoes. 0 0.9 grams of fiber, 1.5 grams of protein, and 0 0.45 grams of salt. So reasonably high in salt from what they are. Uh, so yeah, pretty standard Pringles. Um, most Pringles are the same when it comes to their calories and all their stuff. So yeah, I'm interested to, to try them. It says you get a free seven-day Xbox Game Pass with every can. I wonder if I can... Because I've already got the Game Pass, I wonder if I can top that up, top that up onto my Game Pass and get just seven days for free before they take my next um, monthly thing. Who knows? Um, a chance to win a Xbox. I might pin for that because if I can win an Xbox for free, brilliant. Right, let's uh, break these bad boys open. I need a drink or something. I think I've got some Iron Brew over here. I'm going to go grab that. I am Iron Man. Right, got some Iron Brew because, yeah, my mouth's really dry and my lips are really chappy today. Which is the reason why I'm not trying these just now. I'll try these another day because if I eat them while well, I've got my, my lips are all chapped, it's, they'll hurt. They'll hurt. And, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't want to be in that much pain. Um, right. So, yeah, they look like Pringles. Slight red tint to them. Very, very slight red, more orangey tint to them. That's the powder. Mm, they smell bacony. They smell smoky, which is good. Smell a little cheesy. So they look decent. I swear these have gotten smaller, though, like since I was a kid. Maybe I was just smaller then. I don't know. But I swear the Pringles have gotten smaller. I feel like they used to be a lot bigger. Uh, so here's a few of the things. In fact, I won't do it, because if I do that, I'll just taste them anyway, right? <laughs> I was going to say, here's a few of the things you can do with Pringles. I was going to make a duck face and all that. We'll do that after. Right, let's do it. So these are the limited edition Pringles, bacon, mac and cheese flavour. Let's give them the old taste test, shall we? Normally I wouldn't eat that many before I talk to you again about um, what they're like, but I didn't want to stop eating them. Mmm, <laughs> those are good. Wow, those are great. Yeah, those are lovely. That's, I don't know if I need to say much more than that, to be honest. Pringles, let's be honest, they are good. Pringles are always good. I, I can't think of a single flavor of Pringle that I've had that I didn't like. You know, I love the paprika ones, I love the sour cream and onion ones, even the salt and vinegar ones are nice. And, yeah, these are no exception. Lovely. They've got a lovely sort of meaty, hammy flavour to them. They've got the smokiness of the bacon, which is delicious. And then they've got that hint of cheese. It's like fake cheese, like fake craft dinner mac and cheese. And, yeah, it's, it's good. It's a lovely combination. There's more than enough of the seasoning salt on each crisp as well. So you don't get any blind spots where there's no flavour. Mmm. Yeah. Oh, those are lovely. They taste like bacon. They taste like fake cheese. And I love fake cheese. Um, calling them mac and cheese is obviously a marketing gimmick. They obviously don't take, taste like <laughs> macaroni. But uh, cheese and bacon flavoured. Oh, smashing. Brilliant. Right, I'm really looking forward to these other ones now because... Um, yeah, just trying these now has just reminded me of how much I, I do love Pringles. I never buy them. I never buy them. I always look at them and think, yeah, they're a bit expensive. But 
we actually add it up how much you actually get in a in a pot in a tin um, compared to like a big bag of crisps or something that they're actually not that expensive they're actually not bad um, maybe on the upper range of crisps but still still not bad anyway so yeah I need to buy Pringles more often because I love Pringles love them yeah those are great really really nice lovely smokiness lovely bacon flavour and that cheese mm. Mm, I'm gonna eat more of these I'm gonna hold off for now because I do have lunch on just now I'm making some sausage rolls and uh, I don't want to fill up on crisps before those are ready well that will do for today. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, hit the bell to get notifications and subscribe and leave me a comment. Uh, let me know what you think. And yeah, I would suggest you go out and buy these if you like crisps because these are delicious. Very, very nice. Could endorse them more. Thanks very much, guys. I will see you in the next one. Maybe it'll be the spicy ones. Maybe you'll get to see me sweat. Subscribe.